Manufacturing, process planning, and ARIS Innovator is found here in the table of contents, but this demonstration is going to look all across the software at the many connection points that bring manufacturing, engineering, quality, and other types of data together. Beginning in the process plan itself, we can drill through to the engineering data that the process plan is written against. From the engineering part, we're able to see the part numbers, the bill of material structure information, including many levels and layers that this product rolls up to, and any other information contained against the part, including changes. In Aris Innovator, part information can include requirements, so this means the manufacturing engineer can drill down right into the business level and other key requirements for the part. It also means that manufacturing engineers have access directly to the 3D CAD information that engineering has access to, which means they can drill through into the CAD visuals, turn on and off parts in order to view them better, and make selections to further interpret the 3D visualization in case they need to. Connected with every part in Aris Innovator is the visual collaboration feature that's located right here. And it's a discussion thread style interface, just like in any social media application, which means that the manufacturing engineer can participate in interactions and collaboration with other parts of the team, including engineers that built the product in the first place. The manufacturing engineer may also want a more visual representation of all the data connected with this product. And he or she can find that here, right inside of the graph navigation tool. Graph navigation is a record of all the relationships set up against this part. So anyone on your manufacturing team, again, with permissions, can drill down and see all the related parts in the bill of materials. It goes down as many levels as your bill of materials structure does and lets you navigate to just the right part in the structure that you're looking for. All of the links in the product will take you to another form very similar to the one above it. So in this way, the manufacturing engineer can drill all the way through to the engineering data he or she might need. Working our way back upstream to the process plan we started with, we can see what other data it might be linked to. That's found here in the where used option. So this process plan is a deliverable against a project. We can get right to the project here. This gives the manufacturing engineer insight into things like which phase of the project they're in right now and where this manufacturing plan might become a critical deliverable. So this creates the round trip between a project and its process plan. I also want you to note here that the process quality document, PQD, is also available as a deliverable on the project. So we can open that right up from the project as well. And this will be important in a future demonstration to show how process quality ties into manufacturing process planning and the two are interlinked. So as you can see, the process plan that this process quality document was created against is available right here. And likewise, the where used shows that relationship as well. And it's also represented at the data level. So you'll see data connected from the process quality document to the process plan in a future demonstration in the manufacturing process planning application.